ஹாய் ஹலோ வணக்கம் அண்ட் வெல்கம் டு த ஃபஸ்ட் ஸ்டெப் அகாடமி லேர் அண்ட் க்ரோ எஜுகேஷனல் மீடியம் ஸோ நவ் த ப்ராப்ளம் இஸ் சிம்பிளிஃபை பி ஸ்கொயர் மைனஸ் டென் பி ப்ளஸ் டுவெண்ட்டி ஒன் டிவைட் பை பி மைனஸ் செவன் இன்டு பி ஸ்கொயர் ப்ளஸ் பி மைனஸ் டுவெல் டிவைட் பை பி மைனஸ் த்ரீ ஹோல் ஸ்கொயர் ஸோ லுக் அட் திஸ் ப்ராப்ளம் இட் இஸ் ஆல்சோ இன் ப்ராடக்ட் அண்ட் வி குட் நாட் டைரெக்ட்லி கேன்சல் பிகாஸ் two polynomials are there in the numerators so first what we have to do in the sense we have to factorize these two polynomials we will get the factors through which the factors we may cancel directly right so in that manner first i am choosing this as polynomial 1 and this as polynomial 2 so i am going to factorize these two polynomials now so the first polynomial polynomial is p squared minus 10p plus 21 so we should factorize this polynomial so look at the constant is 21 right plus 21 that's much important so if i multiply two numbers that should provide plus 21 at the same time if i add those two number that should provide minus 10 so we have to select those two numbers right so in that manner if you look uh, minus 7 and minus 3 am i right So minus seven into minus three is plus twenty one. At the same time, if we add these two numbers, we will provide minus ten. Am I right? Right. So through which I am going to factorize this. Look at here, p square. This minus ten p can be written, can be split up as minus three p and minus seven p plus twenty one. The constant that I am writing here. Now look at these two terms. So p is common. So I am taking outside. So p minus three. So p remains here. Here minus three remains. So hence I am writing writing as p minus three. Here look at minus seven is common in these two terms. So I am taking outside. So remaining here p. Here we have minus three. Am I right? So minus seven into minus three is plus twenty one. Hence I am writing as p minus three. Look at in this p minus three common in these two. So p minus three I am taking outside. So rest of things are. P minus seven because P remains here minus seven remains here so P minus seven. So the factors of these first polynomials are P minus three and P minus seven. Right. We'll go to the second polynomial. So what is one? P squared plus P minus twelve. So same way that we are going to factorize now. If I multiply two numbers, that should provide minus twelve. If I add those two numbers, that should provide plus one. So plus four and minus three are those two numbers. So multiply plus four minus three will provide minus twelve. If I add these two number, will provide plus one. Am I right? Good. Now I'm going to write in the same manner that p squared, where minus three p and plus four p minus twelve. This plus p I'm split it into minus three p plus four p. Am I right? Value will not change. Right. Now I'm going to Pick up these two factors, these two terms. In these two terms, p is common, so I'm taking outside. So p remains here, minus three remains here, so p minus three. Same way here, these two terms, I'm going to take plus four outside because that is a common in these two terms. So p remains here, here minus three. Am I right? So now in these two terms, look at p minus three, p minus three is all common. So p minus three, I'm taking outside. Rest of the values are p plus four. These are the two factors of this polynomial two. Am I right? So we found now the factors of those polynomials. Now we have to substitute these factors into this expression, right? So now I'm going to substitute here in polynomial one. The factors are p minus three into p minus seven divided by p minus seven. Next, the factors of polynomials two is p minus three into p plus four. Am I right? Good. Divided by. Look at here, p minus three whole square is there. We don't want to apply formula at all. Just I'm splitting as p minus three into p minus three. It's a simple manner, right? Right. Now look at. So p minus seven, p minus seven will cancel mutually. So p minus three, this p minus three will cancel. Same way, this p minus three and this p minus three will cancel. 
so remaining value is only p plus 4 so we simplified now the value is p plus 4 that is the answer so the problem is simplify p square minus 10 p plus 21 divided by p minus 7 into p square plus p minus 12 divided by p minus 3 whole square we simplified this expression the value is p plus 4 that is the answer hope you understand here we need to factorize the given polynomial and we have to apply in a suitable place and cancel the possible values and we'll get the answer hope you understand thank you